welcome back to the vlog channel um my makeup doesn't match my neck because i thought i grabbed my darker makeup this morning like because i have self tanner on and i definitely did not so we are about to head out to do like i don't know if i don't want to call it bible study because it's not what it is devotional study devotion time god time <laughs> with our friends this is the book we're reading i talked about it in a different vlog i believe it's like a 365 day devotional so i am getting so close to 10,000 followers on instagram let me show you guys hold on 9600 so if you are not yet following me on instagram make sure you do i'm going to be doing shameless shout outs like every week come on guys even though I haven't done anything on my Instagram story today. <laughs> but I put up this picture today because this top is only like $35, I think. I wanted to share it again. So, if you do not follow me, then follow me because we are almost there. My goal was to hit it before the end of February. I don't see that happening. Um, it might. So I want to hit it by my birthday. My birthday is on March 20th. Okay. I'm filming a video and she was climbing on the curtains. So I open the curtains and then she jumps on top of the door and then there. What? Like, what are you doing? You just need the attention? Yeah. Sashi. You good, girl? You good. All right, come on. Get down. Down. Yeah, I know. You got up there, though. You can get down. All right, Mommy's got to film. Come, Mommy's got to film. Hey, guys. Okay, so I just got done filming a um, lookbook video. I feel like it was all over the place because I'm just an all-over-the-place gal. But, oh, come on. There's a little sneaky-beaky. Actually, no, there's nothing. Just... <sighs> the video will have already gone up. I'm just losing it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Anyway, head to my channel if you want to see that video. <laughs> so, we're going to go heat up dinner now, and I have to edit the video that I just filmed. I'm not quite sure what else we're doing tonight. What are we doing tonight, babe? Soup. Eating soup. That's pretty much it. Nothing exciting, right, Doug? Hey, guys. So, sorry about last night. I um was just completely, like not paying attention and I didn't notice that the battery thing was flashing so the camera just like literally died in the middle of filming and both batteries were dead. So I am done with work for the day. I am sitting here with a blanket wrapped around me like a two year old uploading tonight's YouTube video. And I'm so bummed because Sam and my um, closet, like we're gonna be, excuse me, redoing our closet soon. And I went to have everything delivered from Ikea because the nearest Ikea is an hour and a half away. So I went to have everything delivered and one item was out of stock. It didn't give me the option to like purchase everything and then when it comes back in stock, like it'll ship almost like a back order. It didn't give me that. And I called them and they said it could be like two weeks until something comes back in stock. And so I'm also scared that like I don't buy, you know, this stuff now and then in two weeks something else is just gonna be out of stock. So I'm just like, I have literally no idea what to do. Um, I mean, I, I just, so I'm trying to kind of like brainstorm now, like, should I buy everything as is and then just like, see, I don't know. Y'all listen to this fat cat snoring. Oh my gosh, girl, lose some weight. Okay, um, so super weird, but I actually was able to get everything ordered from Ikea. So I went and I was just gonna see how much shipping was for um, one of the, like the item that they were claiming was out of stock so that if I just ordered everything else, um, maybe later when it came back in stock, I could order that one piece. 
and it was like, you know, sign up for an Ikea account, not like a credit account, but just like sign up for an Ikea account and you can get like 10% off or something. So the shipping ended up being free on that piece and the piece was in stock, but only when I ordered it by itself. So super weird, but I got everything ordered. I'm so excited. I'm literally standing in my closet right now just like dreaming of how perfect it's gonna be. So um, I'm about to go clean. I will give you guys a quick little tour. I don't think I've ever really showed you guys my full closet. Like I've showed you pieces of it, but it's just, I don't like it. Um, so let me, so this is our bedroom. Obviously you've seen this before and we always keep this store open because I mean, it literally is just like, like why keep this shut? So this used to be an outdoor like porch maybe, or maybe a screened in porch. Um, so we need to change the light fixture because that is mm, mm, very bad. But when you walk in, this is kind of what you see. So this um, house, we're actually renting it. It has come, oh, there's been like three or four different like tenants, I guess. And so this space has been used for so many different things. This space right here, I think this was put in and this was put in maybe two tenants ago. Um, so this was originally all that they had for closets. So they used this right here and then that, and then they had like drawers over here. So when we moved in, I just kind of was like, it's really ugly. One thing that's gonna go is all of the mismatched discolored hangers. That's the first thing that will go, Samuel Jessup. And um, that little thing, but when you walk in, okay, sorry, I got distracted. Did Scott sidetracked. So when you walk in, this is what you see. I had these, I think two, and then I ordered this one. So these are all of my clothes. I hate that that window is blocked. Um, and then I honestly hate that like this isn't a like getting dressed space. Like when we have people over, if I'm ever like getting dressed or doing anything, like it's super weird. I, I anyway, so this mirror will go. These will all come down and then we will have a um, like set three little sets of shelves underneath the windows and those will hold my shoes and then some of Sam's shoes. So this will be gone and then that's going to come down. This will be um, a wall of shelves and then this will be a wall of shelves and I think it would actually just be easier if I just showed you guys what the actual like rendering looks like from the ikea website but this is the before it's not that great we have like some shoes over here like my shoes sam's shoes that random like junky set of drawers i think i had that in college for like school stuff and somehow it's like managed to be like a drawer set in here it's just it's a lot very random so i'll show you what we're planning right now. Okay, so this is actually, I'm just showing you um, the quick little screenshot that I got. So this is from the website. You can go on and it is kind of a confusing program to learn, but I definitely recommend doing this. So when you come in, this is the door right here. And then like, this is the wall that you like can't see. That's the wall that has the windows. So we will have, this will be, at least this is what we're planning. This will be my clothes. And then there's a little thing for um, my jewelry. And then this will be like my set of drawers where I keep like workout clothes, bras and underwear, bathing suits, things like that. This will also be my hanging area. And then this will be for like long dresses that I have, this little space right here. This will be for sweaters. And then these are just gonna be hanging. And then this is actually the piece right here that was like out of stock that I literally just ordered. Um, we're gonna mix and put both of our pairs of pants on here. And then Sam does not have a lot of shoes. He actually just got rid of a ton of pair, like not even long ago. Okay, that didn't make sense. He just got rid of a lot um, of his like running shoes and stuff not that long ago. So he doesn't have a ton of shoes. So his like regular tennis shoes and stuff like that will go here. And then his dressier shoes will go on the other side with the shelves. So I am so excited. Sam's such a smart ass. So he just got like some clothes in and he was trying them on. He was like, oh, you're not gonna do an unboxing? And I was like, well, we missed the unboxing part. He missed it. So any of you women out there, can you guys relate to this? It's so unfair 
these pants cost Sam $17. $17. Like, if you find a pair of $17 pants as a woman, you're like, what? What? And he's just like, casually, they've been the same price for years. And I like that shirt on you, babe. $7 shirt? Yeah, you need to put it in the wash. You need to take it off and put it in the washing machine. That's good. I like it. I love taking tags off of things. By the way, I just told Sam, I was like, I don't know if I've ever told this is you about this, but this is my favorite thing. Like, I used to come home, and I had a little pile on my bed, and I would, like, take everything off. Show them your shirt. Look at this color on him. Doesn't it look good? It's like a... Khaki. Yeah, because it's got a little bit of gray and a little bit of brown. It looks so good. Please take it off, though, and, like, put it in the washing machine before I just start to like spaz out. I don't know if I've mentioned what's tomorrow, love? Our uh, five year dating, I guess, anniversary. Mm -hmm. My dad was like, no, that's not Ow. how it works. Ow. You don't celebrate your dating anniversary. You're married. He goes, that's like when a parent tells you that their four year old child is 48 months. That's literally what he said this is compared to. He was like, you're not 48 months, you're two years. So. He thinks it's silly that we're celebrating it, but. And I used to think it was stupid. I'd be, I'd see couples that would celebrate their dating anniversary, and I was like, really? But then, I mean, five years, it's like, this is probably gonna be the last one we'll celebrate until we hit 10. I just can't see celebrating, like, ever. I can't believe we're coming up on year two of marriage. Or I guess coming up on our second anniversary, so technically we're about to start year three just crazy okay so these pants were $17 and Sam got two pairs literally when did you order these um, I honestly don't know last week so I think we're gonna close out the vlog here because Sam really wants to edit it now so it will be up tomorrow and when so when you're watching this it will be our anniversary so thanks you guys for watching subscribe below and join the fam